This is Rosalyn on Radio 1 and we have the Lebanese French rapper Ramaz with us who put together the song Lish Hek Balade. Hi Rosalyn, how are you? Hi Ramaz, how are you feeling today? Very good, thanks. It's very nice to have you here with us in the studio. Why don't you tell us more about the song Lish Hek Balade which was very famous, very popular over the last few months here in Lebanon. Actually the song uh, Lish Hek Balade uh, it talks about the situation we had to face in Lebanon but it's actually a positive message to towards peace trying to unite people and look beyond all the stereotypes that are building into the community so that we can all make a difference. That's very beautiful. And, and, and how, did, how did you decide you wanted to create a song for the country? I mean, what inspired you? How did that happen? Actually, it's very straightforward. It's the country. Yeah. I love this country. Like, I used to come to Lebanon only on vacation. It's the most beautiful place in the world. That's my opinion, at least. I really love this place. That's great. We're so happy to have you with us. And tell me, when, when did you actually put the song together? Or when did you actually write the lyrics? Because you wrote the lyrics and you sang as well. You rap. Uh, yeah, actually, I I created the the song Le Chèque Balade was in 2001, so that's a while ago. Wow, a while and back. Yeah, but unfortunately, the situation didn't change much, like, between 2001 and 2007. Now I'm hearing from a lot of people that 2008 is a good year, for, so let's hope it's going to stay this yeah, way. Yeah, let's and hope. And you performed the song live, right? At the time, yeah. It was at la Fête de la Musique mainly that the song received a good feedback from the, the crowd. The and where would you perform in concerts, like here in Lebanon, obviously? Actually, I'm performing pretty much everywhere where uh, people like invite you to perform and actually work in a professional way. Mm -hmm. And so you've uh, performed outside Lebanon. Where else have you performed? I performed in the U.S. Uh, mainly because I used to study uh, in the University of Wisconsin Whitewater, and there was some guys uh, I performed with at the time who was uh, Armor Gideon and Stas. We did at the time a song called Yora Patpe, okay. which actually inspired me for a little bit of the chorus of Leshek Baradi. Mm -hmm. And uh, the song was made after after September 11 because a lot of people didn't really perceive the situation in the way it was. Like a lot of people in the U.S. were like, all Arabs are terrorists. And at the time I had a radio show and I, I went on air and the first thing I said was, not all Arabs are terrorists. And no. did anyone listen? <laughs> I, actually, a lot of people <laughs> listened. Oh. And it was, it, it, was, it was nice to see how people link many different things just to get to say, you're a terrorist when you're actually a human just like anyone else. But you have a CD right you've released a cd now that's right and uh, it's, it's selling all over lebanon right it's uh, selling all over lebanon and uh, the name of the cd is le Sheikh Baradi. okay there's other songs how many uh, songs CD. are on the cd actually there's only six songs okay because i was produced for this cd and i wanted to produce a good work okay so i sacrificed quite a few amount of songs because i wanted th this cd to look exactly the way i am right it's like an introduction to to who i am it's and your uh, first first cd basically the first release the first official cd actually there Debut was like two album. songs that were selected on a compilation in the u.s mm -hmm. but it's the first okay great the first baby if you want to say and um are they all the, are all the songs affiliated with Lebanon and the situation here or are some songs different? Actually there's a bit of everything but in this CD they all relate to Lebanon. Mm -hmm. Like there's a song called Le Boulet. It tells you like the difference between a guy and a girl and like how there's a cut of access to discuss with, how fun. with okay. each other. Like It's like the communication between a guy and a girl and how it can differ. differ. How cool. So. No, I definitely want to hear that song now. <laughs> Great. <laughs> and now we've got a song that's playing on Radio 1. It's been playing for the last three or four weeks as well. One of your songs is it too much asking? Yeah. Is that on the CD as well? This song is actually the continuity of Le Sheikh Baladé. Okay. In Le Sheikh Baladé, we were asking a question mm -hmm. and we were not getting the answer. And is okay. it too much asking? We're still asking a question, but we get some answers. And is it the same girl that features, what's her name, the girl that features with you in Le Sheikh Baladé? It's Sulaf. Sulaf. Yeah. Is she also featuring in this song as well? Actually, there's her voice uh, in, in the background. She's okay. not like in the main uh, front. But it was important for me to have her there because the songs are, are related. I mean, it's a continuity and yeah. she'll be on the second CD for sure. So Great. And so what are your plans now? You said you might be in La Fête de la Musique. Uh, yeah, that will be the 21st of June. Very cool. And it's, it will be a free concert so everyone can attend. And how can we find out more about like when you might be performing? Um, you have a website. Uh, that's right. There is the official website, which is www.ramezonline.com. Com. Okay, cool. So then we should keep posted to find out when you're next you're going to be performing. Or you can invite me every week and I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs>